Hello and welcome back to the channel. Tis I, Ken Levine, singer slash vocal coach. And today we are looking at another suggestion from one of our dear subscribers, Luke, who writes, Hi, Ken. Just wondering if you could give review of this live street side performance from Ren and Sam Tompkins. And Luke kindly leaves a link there so I don't have to figure out what it is that Luke is meaning, which particular performance it is. And that is good because... <laughs> I love Ren and his performances, but the last one I witnessed absolutely left me gutted completely and uh, ruined for uh, some time afterwards. Hi, Ren. It was an absolutely powerhouse performance. I love this performer and uh, I'm excited to take a look at what he does live street side. I saw another performance of his, The Big Push, but let's dive into this one. This one's, I think, from a about five years ago, and I think it's a fan cam, so, or a fan cam, maybe just someone with a cell phone, that which we will f hopefully discover is of good quality. Falsetto from Sam Tompkins. What an incredible range. So effortlessly as he floats on up there. And one of the things that I noticed right off technically, his voice was enveloped with a sense of ease. La, da, da, la. And can you hear those upper resonance, upper partials on my voice when you hear that? It's all that, that sense of air means that uh, there's a lovely... Uh, I guess a breathy onset, but actually helps to inform uh, a sense of legato and ease that all of that messaging is there. And then, of course, when he sails up to those high falsetto notes, brilliant. I love it. I'm a kid for you, 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 you. Hey, because girl, you're perfect. Girl, you're perfect. You're always worth it. Oh. So Ren, is, they're doing this call and response, and Ren is matching him note for note while playing the guitar. Ren is an uh, insanely talented young man from the UK. If you're not familiar with his work, check it out. It, will, it blew my mind as what was possible in th this ever-expanding genre of pop music that just, I think he sort of bends that. It's more soulful, bluesy, rock, uh, all of those things combined. And uh, there he is showing off his powerful vocal chops. Sam Tompkins got range. Amazing. Care for you. And I'm a care for you, 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 you. Hey. Cause girl, you're perfect. Girl, you're perfect. You're always worth it. Always worth it. And you deserve it. You deserve it. The way you're working, girl. You. Uh, This is a man. 
Nice. Uh, I'm trying to make sense of the sounds that I'm hearing. It certainly does feel like this is a live performance, which it is, but I think they probably have a, another recording device in Ren's setup there. You can see he's got a massive pedal board, lots of effects there. Fantastic. Great to add that little bit of reverb or a lot of reverb onto the vocals, onto the guitar sound. And I think that he's recording it and then maybe they've added a little bit of the fan or crowd sound post totally fine i think it was a wise choice because then we get a really clean sound from the vocals from the guitar and then adding a little bit of the fan sound afterwards in post is totally fine it gives us again a sense of time and place we don't feel so disjointed that they're not involved like the rest of the sonic environment isn't involved in the scene but it wouldn't mean nothing Without a woman or a girl. Again, nice little segue in from one song to the other. Nice Don't you know mashup, the man made a car to take him over the road? The man made the train to carry. can't understand a word he's saying. Wonderful dynamic range going down from that low baritone all the way up to this high head voicey sound that is, uh, yeah, so in control of his vocal instrument. Would love a little bit more articulation onto the words, but it's about the feel, it's about the vibe. Uh, more about that later. As well. those voices together it's a, a, a beautiful symphony of vocal harmony i love it love it i love how they're just riffing this i mean obviously these moments m have been pre-planned and uh sam coming to the microphone and just finishing off or com dovetailing into the next song with that beautiful melismatic passage that he did there all over the map. Yeah, amazing, amazing. Thank you, Luke. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I might not have discovered this otherwise, so thank you very much for sharing that link. Uh, you can be like Luke, too, and you can uh, share a link with me th via the links down below in the description of this, but more. Listen to more. Makes me confused. Of love with you, I, 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 I never love someone the way that I, I love you. Yeah. 
got the loop pedal going. Look at that crowd. Everyone's throwing cash into the guitar case there. That's awesome. Imagine being able to just walk down your local street on your way to the pub and enjoy uh, like these superstar musicians just jamming right on your street. It's fantastic. Love it. This guy in the back, you see him with his blue shirt there. Um, what's going on here? I, I'm just, oh man, I'm just trying to get to the shops before they close. <laughs> Have you ever had that awkward moment walking through some street performance? You just turn a corner and you're like, oh, no. Now I'm committed. Now I got to keep on walking through this performance. Uh, I'm going to just do it as quickly as possible and make no eye contact. Okay. We've gotten into the whale sounds <laughs> part of the solo. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Guys. You're welcome. No, thank you. Absolutely. And thank you, Luke, again. One of the things that I, I hinted at earlier in this reaction when I was talking about, it's not so much about the words, when Ren was kind of off in his own world, uh, not necessarily articulating the world, words all that much, just much more about the vibe. And I kind of think that that's, um, that's something that we lose a little bit here on the channel in that we don't necessarily articulate how important vibe or that feeling of the song is. I'm speaking for myself here. I think I kind of get a little too gaga over the technical prowess and uh, less about the overall feeling. And uh, that... That's something that um, well, I need to I need to be mindful of in future reactions because they are affecting, you know. And and sometimes it's just about the the groove and the vibe and the and the the sensation of being in that moment as opposed to thinking critically about the articulation of every vowel and syllable. There's more I could say about that, but I'm gonna leave it there. I think this video is already long enough and uh, that's okay too. I just would like to remind you to please leave a comment down below in the chat. Those are a few of my thoughts, but maybe you have thoughts of your own. What did you think of this performance? What do you think of Ren? What do you think of Mr. Sand Tompkins and their vocal prowess? And also, too, if you want to be like Luke, you can cut through all of the noise in the chatter and get to me directly via the links down below. And if you are so kind, you could also leave a kind donation, just like Luke did. So thank you so much. Also, too, if you're not yet a member of this fabulous community... What are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up 
icon as well as the bell icon. It helps feed the algorithm and the algorithm will help to feed you more content like this so you don't miss out on any of the great stuff that we produce here every week on the channel. And as soon as I can art properly, speaking of articulation, properly articulate my words, I will say something to the tune of thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day and spending a few of those precious moments here with me on the channel. Much love and appreciation to you all. Take care out there, stay safe, and we will see you next time. But it wouldn't mean nothing. <laughs>